There are two wolves fighting in the man's heart. One is called love, the other, hate. Hey everyone and welcome to The Paradise List. Today we're counting down the 10 best historical fantasy movies. Let's get started. This is the end. This is just the start. Number 10, Snow White and the Huntsman. Snow White and the Huntsman is an American fantasy film. Based on the German fairy tale Snow White compiled by the Brothers Grimm, the movie follows Queen Ravenna, who seized control of her kingdom by marrying and killing its rightful ruler, needs the life force of young maidens to maintain her beauty, however, to become truly immortal. Ravenna must consume the heart of her stepdaughter Snow White, Snow escapes, and Ravenna dispatches a huntsman to capture her, but Snow, the huntsman, and a rebel army join forces to destroy Ravenna and restore the balance of life and death. The film was released in May 2012. Bring me your heart, my dear, dear Snow White. Number 9, Alpha. Alpha is an American prehistorical adventure film. Directed by Albert Hughes, the movie follows young Kada, tries to survive alone in the wilderness after he's left for dead. During his first hunt with his Cro-Magnon tribe, he soon forms an unlikely alliance with a lone wolf that was abandoned by its pack, facing overwhelming odds and non-stop danger. Kada and the wolf must now trek through a harsh and unforgiving landscape to make it home before winter. The film was released in March 2018. Number 8, Your Highness. There live two brothers, one brave and bold, the other not so much. Woo! Your Highness is an American stoner comic fantasy film, directed by David Gordon Green. The movie follows Prince Thaddeus, has always lived his life in the shadow of his brother, the heir apparent, Prince Fabius. Tired of always being passed over, Thaddeus is now content to slack off drink mead, and enjoy the company of a maiden or two. While Fabius has fabulous adventures, but when an evil wizard kidnaps Fabius' fiancé, Thaddeus has no choice but to find his inner hero and join his brother's quest to save her, and the film was released in April 2011. Hello. Nice to meet you. Number 7, Kingdom of Heaven. Be without fear. In the face of your enemies. Kingdom of Heaven is an epic historical fiction drama film, directed and produced by Ridley Scott. The story is set during the Crusades of the 12th century. A French village blacksmith goes to the aid of the Kingdom of Jerusalem in its defense against the Ayyubid Muslim Sultan, Saladin, who is fighting to claim back the city from the Christians. This leads to the Battle of Hattin. The screenplay is a heavily fictionalized portrayal of the life of Balian of Ibelin, and the film was released in May 2005. I go to pray. For what? For the strength to endure what is to come. Number 6, The Scorpion King. In one week's time, the prophecy will be fulfilled. The Scorpion King is an American sword and sorcery action adventure film directed by Chuck Russell. It is a spin-off of the Mummy franchise and launched the Scorpion King film series, the film Marks Johnson's first lead role. The events of the Scorpion King take place 5,000 years before the events of the Mummy, and the Mummy returns, revealing the origins of Matthias and his rise to power as the legendary hero the Scorpion King. The name is a reference to a historical king of the proto-dynastic period of Egypt King Scorpion. The film was released in April 2002. Number 5, Pathfinder. There are two wolves fighting in the man's heart. One is called love, the other, hate. Pathfinder is an American epic action film, directed by Marcus Nispel. The movie follows a Viking boy, nicknamed Ghost, is adopted by the Wampanoag tribe, 
after surviving a shipwreck despite a legend that death and destruction will follow the boy wherever he travels. Over the course of a decade, the young Norseman grows into a fierce warrior and battles against rampaging Vikings, who slaughter the tribes, he defends the woman he loves by waging a one-man war against his countrymen, and becomes the savior and defender of the Wampanoag people. It was released in April 2007. Run and you may live. Fight them, you will die. Number 4, 10,000 BC. Ten Thousand BC is an American action adventure film directed by Roland Emmerich. The movie follows mammoth hunter Lay, has long been in love with a beautiful, blue-eyed tribeswoman named Evelette. After horseback riding raiders kidnap most of his Lay's fellow tribesmen, as well as Evelette, he sets out on a dangerous trek to rescue her from her captor. And Ten Thousand BC released in March 2008. He is not a god. Number 3, 300. Open! 300 is an American epic historical action film, based on the 1998 comic series of the same name by Frank Miller and Lynn Varley, both are fictionalized retellings of the Battle of Thermopylae in the Persian Wars, the plot revolves around King Leonidas, who leads 300 Spartans into battle against the Persian god King Xerxes and his invading army of more than 300,000 soldiers. As the battle rages, Queen Gorgo attempts to rally support in Sparta for her husband. The story is framed by a voiceover narrative by the Spartan soldier Dilios. Through this narrative technique, various fantastical creatures are introduced, placing 300 within the genre of historical fantasy, and it was released in February 2007. Number 2, Noah. Noah is an American epic biblical drama film, directed by Darren Aronofsky. Inspired by the biblical story of Noah's Ark from the book of Genesis, Noah received generally positive reviews from critics and grossed over $362 million worldwide making it Aronofsky's highest-grossing film to date. It was denied release in China for religion-related reasons. According to an anonymous source, it was also banned in several Muslim countries due to its depiction of prophets venerated in Islam. The film was released in March 2014. Before we jump to number one, here are a few honorable mentions. Number 1, Clash of the Titans. It is time for the mortals to pay. Clash of the Titans is a British American fantasy action film franchise based on characters and myths of ancient Greek mythology. The first film Clash of the Titans was released in 1981 with a remake made in 2010. The movie follows Perseus the son of Zeus, is caught in a war between gods and is helpless to save his family from Hades, the god of the underworld. With nothing left to lose, Perseus leads a band of warriors on a dangerous quest to prevent Hades from overthrowing the king of the gods and laying waste to earth. The film was released in April 2010. 